Chris, Susie, it's been years. It's been ever so long. Yeah, yeah, it's been, what, a day? No, it's been years. Oh, that's it? Short, isn't it? It's just that I've never had friends before, so I've never waited so long to see them again either. It's been a decade here. Where have you been? Fine. <clears throat> Fine. Guess we'll try not to let you die of loneliness. I bet Lancer wants to see us too, right? Hey, wait a sec. Where is Lancer? Where's everybody? Worry not, Susie. You'll see them in a moment. I killed all of them, and soon you'll be joining them, and then it will just be me and Chris forever. Just wait here, all right? Okay. Hey, this better not be some kind of prank or something. Chris, I have something to ask you. I need you to return to the light world. Oh, God. And go to the old classroom to the east of the closet doors. But how does he know? Inside, gather everything on the ground. And bring it back here, could you? What? Okay, sure thing, buddy. I was making a joke about you killing people, but... We're already returning to the... Over... Okay. Yeah. Just wanted to show off your huge house, huh? No, what I want to show you is upstairs. It's a gun. I've got a gun. No girls. Girls got to die. Wake up with no whoosh. Who yo who yo yeah. I can't, I can. I have a surprise for you two. I made rooms for you in the castle. Rooms? So you can stay here whenever you want. Um, I'd be happy if this place could be like a second home to you. A place that you can go, no matter what's happening outside. <laughs> well, we'll take a look. I was kidding about the- I'm- I'm- Why am I getting so many va bad vibes from Ralsei now? Alright, enough already, let's get going. But what about Ralsei? Good luck today, Chris. See you soon. The fact that he has his arms behind his back is just really frightening to me. I don't know why. Also, I'm happy to report that I'm not the only one who thought that Ralsei was up to something. Like, I, I I thought I'd point that out. I was getting some bad vibes from him at the very beginning. I'm happy to know that a lot of people apparently do have bad vibes from him in this. So it's not just me. I just thought I'd say that. <laughs> How's that? Meet the new healing master, Chris. Oh yes, she is the real master at it, Chris. God teaching you sarcasm was a mistake. Chris, where the hell are we? Sorry. <laughs> oh, Chris, what's that you've got there? Is that a gift for someone? Why, yes, it is, Rosie. Uh, we gave it to Susie last time, and I gave it to Birdly in my Papyrus playthrough. Who do we give it to this time? I, I'll win something for you too, okay? One baseball, please. Oh, wait a second. Jeez, Rosie. Get dunked on! Die, reindeer! There's only room for one horny furry in here. Susie! The hell are you blaming me for? You made the trap! Susie? Do I need to repeat that song? I got a gun, no girls. Girls gotta die. Wake up with no oo-woo. All right, look, man. You don't have to oo-woo me. Ooh, what's this? Notice is your axe. Oh God! How do you like your new room units? As you can see, they are perfectly suited to your interests, which I glean from your internet search results. Chris, do you want to talk? There's a lot of how do you get with goat boy searches. 
I mean, I'm not one to judge. I, I'm just, if you want to talk, I'm here. Rosie, you got any bright ideas? Yes. I'm going to be dressing up like a dapper goat boy. I hope Chris will like it. Okay. Hey, where the hell's Rosie? Getting dapper as hell. Um, you don't have to scream. I know I'm dapper as heck. You see, each dark fountain creates a different world. A world whose darkness reflect the will of its fountain. But though those darkness can exist in their own worlds, they might not belong if they go to another world. But me, I'm fine though. I can go wherever I want. That's not suspicious at all, is it? I'm just traveling wherever the heck. So don't worry about me. 100%. Rosie talked in a soft voice to all the enemies. They're there. It's okay, little kitty. Hey, little kitty, let me whisper in your ear. Tell you something that you might like to hear. I got a treat. There's a key. There's the key. I knew what you were going to say, Chance. Uh, I see you. Uh... A giant hand. Sure would be nice to be pet by something like that. Pet Rosie! Pet Rosie! Pet him! Dang it, we can't. This wear wire, 15, 25%. You jiggled your body. Rosie charmed the wire. I don't know, I think Christine's being charming herself right now. Look at that shake. Look at those little hip shakes. The noodle arms. Who wouldn't be attracted to that? Oh, I seem to be getting all hot and bothered. <laughs> Let's go, Chris. Time for us to smooch. You can pet me if you want to, Chris. I, I I won't hold back. I, I'll just, you know, sit down and let you pet my my head or or, or in the back of my head or my forehead or or my mouth for some reason. I'm okay with anything, really. Just just please pet me. Susie, sometimes she isn't nice at all. She's selfish. She's rude. She's sarcastic. She's. I hate her. I hate her guts. I'm going to kill her, Chris. I want to... I've got a gun. No girls. Girls got to die. Sorry. Old habit. Sorry. <laughs> I, I got off track. Let's just enjoy the ride, Chris. <laughs> Maybe you can hug me, please. Oh, that's right. Rose isn't compatible with this world either. But I am somehow. But don't read really into that, Chris, okay? Just like... Ignore the fact that I, the fluffy boy, am the only other darkener from a different place that can survive somewhere else, okay? It doesn't mean anything, I promise. Well then, why don't we close our eyes and think about what she's doing now? Also, here's a... Here's something to note. Our job right now is to distract the Queen, and Rawls even says we need to figure out a way to distract the Queen. Why is he, after taking a long ride, deciding to stop everything before we meet the Queen to say, I wonder how Susie's doing right now? We're supposed to be distracting the Queen, but he's just like, let's think about how Susie is. And it takes quite a while, too. To add on the suspicions with Rawlsy, this does not help it. First, let's go in here, get this statue. Hey, Rawlsy, can we take this from my room? But, but that's stealing... We got it! Oh, all right. Hey, Chris, take this for your room. Um, that would be stealing. You stole... Why does no one listen to me? Like, why? Why won't you listen to the goat boy? And my fluffiness? I thought you loved me! That's it, I'm going to turn fully evil by the end of all this. Just because you don't want to listen to me. What? I said nothing? You don't have to worry about a thing? Queen, think of the lightners! Aren't we supposed to make them happy? Is that all I'm doing? Like, bro! I'm doing my best here, man! What are you doing? I'm offering fluffiness and goat boy material for Chris. Well, I can do that too! 
I've seen her search history. There's a lot there, and I, I, I frankly... Chris, like I said before, if you want to talk, I'm, I'm here. There's, there's a little bit too much Goat Boy material that you've been looking up. Concentrating my will into this blade, I will make a new fountain and unleash a bright future. A future that shines for us. A future whose brightness is born from darkness. Stop. What in the world are you all doing? Well, we thought we could just stop. I mean, stop! Take a chill pill and breathe. Stop it. Get some help. Do you realize what will happen if you do that? I will just... You bring the roaring. Something that I probably could have explained in the last chapter. When the light is subsumed by shadow. When the fountains fill the sky. All will fall into chaos. The titans will take form from the fountains. And envelop the land in devastation. The surviving darkness crushed by the darkness will slowly, one by one, turn into statues, leaving the lightners to fend for themselves. Lost eternally in an endless night. Is that your idea of paradise? Hey, so are we seriously not gonna talk about any of that? That was goddamn weird. Puppets, strings, hands. What the hell does any of that mean? And the way you just Broke? I don't think it meant anything, Susie. It seems like it was just a corrupted program. He turned into our ally, so let's just accept it. Chris, you've got goosebumps. You okay? Okay, so I have heard about this, about the fight. If we say no, something happens. Chris, are you okay? You're yelling. There, there. Everything's all right. Don't think about what happened too hard, okay? Just take some deep breaths and think about something you like, something nice, something soft. Your goat boy's right here for you, girl. I'll be right next to you until you feel better, Chris. You don't have to worry about a thing. Guess Rosie's right, Chris. Whatever just happened, I guess. Maybe it didn't mean anything. I don't know why you came here, but let's just be glad you didn't get killed. <laughs> just tell us next time. You're gonna do something stupid like this, okay? <laughs> <laughs>